Welcome to Let's Play Pac-Man Arrangement. I, uh, this is a, obviously a, uh, arranged version of Pac-Man with a fifth ghost. His name is Kinky. We'll get into what he does later. Or the game could just show you right off the bat. Same, just as Pac-Man. Just eat all the pellets until the until uh, maze is clear. Touch a ghost, you're dead. Uh, I practice this so much. Now there's Kinky right there. I ate him, so he didn't do anything. But if you eat Kinky, like look at that. See that? He's gonna try and chase the other ghosts until he does that. He morphs with a ghost. He fuses with a ghost, so that way they'll gain a special power and become a fat ghost. Like the one I just ate right there. Fat ghosts are worth double the points. He's a fuse with Kinky. But the fact is, they have superpowers, so they're really annoying. Ow! Dang. Alright. Oh well. They get trapped in a pot anyway. Okay, right. Power pellets. You can actually tell the difference between power pellets and regular pellets now, because the power pellets have a big P on them. And I don't need it. This introduces the dash arrows. Since Pac-Man's going so fast, he can't get hurt when touching the ghost during the dash, and if he's powered up with a power pellet, he can actually eat the ghost while dashing. Whoa, did not want to do that. Mushroom. Unfortunately, this is not Mario. Come here. Oh, wait, go around. Take that. Kinky. Kinky appears a few times. Alright, now that I've eaten Kinky, the ghosts are worth double points, so... Oh, hey, I got the wand! Awesome! That's kind of a rare item to see this early in the game. Oh, crap. Ah! Basically what the wand does, it turns them into presents, and you can eat them. Uh, don't ask me why he can eat presents. He just does. Darn it, I missed. Take that. Oh, you jerk! Don't think I'm bad, this is just the Let's Play curse. Alright, now we're in World 1. As you can see, it's just the same as the original Pac-Man maze. Now you see the dots start flashing and turning big? Oh crap. Come here. Big Inky? His power is annoying. Like, all the ghosts, they have some kind of superpower, but Inky and Clyde, the blue, like the light green and orange ghosts, their powers are the most annoying. Blinky's, I don't have a problem with, because by the time he uses it, I'm usually out of his way anyway. Pinky, she just jumps around. She doesn't really do anything. Alright, I've increased my eating speed, so I'm guessing the little big dots, because they're. Oh, crap. The bigger the dots, they slow, they slow you down, but they're worth more points. Alright, stage clear. Now we're at round four. A revamped maze with dash arrows! Ouch. You can also turn while you dash. Okay, I think he just fused with Blinky. Too bad I ate him. Oh, yep, he fused with Blinky, alright. You notice how Blinky has kind of like horns on his head? That means he can charge at you. And if you're in, like, directly in front of him, he will damage you. Well, not damage you. Yeah, see, like that. Uh, give me that. I don't know what that was. Oh, I got the blue pill there. Uh, but you actually get pills in this game, not power pills, because they're power pellets, but not power pills. People make that mistake and call them power pills. Extra life, awesome. Even though, like all in the other, like all the other arrangement games that come with this uh, game. You get infinite continues if you die. So. That's why I'm kind of being careless. Yeah, Blinky, he can charge ahead. 
Not for long, though. Aw, oh, crap. Messed it up. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, now they're starting to add 3D elements such as stairs. Maze is basically the same, though. Blah, 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 blah. Get away, get away. Come here, Kinky. Alright. I ate Kinky. Ooh, pill. Blue pill, you copy Inky's power. This can be sometimes good, this can be sometimes bad, because you eat on opposite sides of the screen. When you meet in the center, you cross. And he dies, like if he touches a ghost or something. Oh, crap. Oh, well. Bye-bye. Continue. Yeah. Any power-ups that were appearing on screen, except for power pellets, when you die and get a continue, they go away. That, include, that includes fruits, pills, staff, whatever. Ow. Yeah, somehow I can program the game to give me six lives instead of five. I don't know why I can do that, why I can't do that in the other arrangement games, but the max you can have in any of the arrangement games except for this one is five. Yeah. Pinky there, she can turn into a rabbit, she can jump around in random locations, usually indicated by the flashing target sign. Like that. <laughs> Thank you for demonstrating when I s mentioned it. And thank you for jumping in a spot where I knew you'd come. Alright, we're almost done with this world. Okay, now you notice how we have these little pads that say jump? That's basically cloning Pinky's power. Because the pink pill doesn't allow you to jump. The pink pill does something entirely different. There's two types of ghost trapping power-ups. There is the... There's the pink pill, and then there's the magic bag. What the magic bag does is that the magic bag... Oh, perfect timing. There it is. Some people say it's a pot. I say it's a bag. Magic bag. All the ghosts, eyes or otherwise, are pulled into the ghost home and held there for a certain number of seconds. Same thing happens if you pick, uh, pick up a pink pill. Alright, now we're in world two. That was fun. Magic bag! Awesome. And a fruit. I don't see why Kinky can't fuse with other ghosts in there, but... Maybe he's a nerd and they don't like him? I feel for you, Kinky. Oh, whoops! Wait, do I auto-turn when I do that? Kinky, Kinky, Kinky. Come here, come here. Gotcha! Blue pill. Okay, fused with Blinky, so now Blinky's a bull. And that Pac Man just disappeared. Alright, we're getting on in time, so we'll leave this off for now and we'll continue next time. I'm Ida the Outcast. See you.